right so uh, let us see few points so this congo red congo red is a uh, member of diazo uh, diazo dies so why it is diazo because here n double bond n n double bond n so these are the chromophores it has got so it uh, belongs to this diazo uh dies right so uh this i have explained these things right so this congo red is a good example good example for this uh direct direct or one more name of this direct die is substantive die right so it is a good example for this direct or substantive die right why it is so because see here in direct die what we do we take this uh uh fabric right so this is my cloth what i will do i will put this in a substance containing this it is nothing but hot dye congo dye let me write right so this is my hot congo dye i immerse this fabric into this hot dye then i will remove it and i'll keep it for drying so that fabric will be colored now so the name itself suggest congo dye congo red dye we call it as right so congo red dye so its color will be red in color uh, there are so it is like in alkali medium like oh minus medium it will be red in color if we add excess of hcl in organic uh, acids if you add in acid medium it will be violet in color violet in color right so it will be in acid medium how it will change from red to violet that we will shall see in the reaction right so first point it is a diazo dye and it is a good example for this direct or substantive dye right so what is this direct dye we take a fabric and we directly add in add it to the hot uh, congo red dye then we will get that fabric is colored when we dry it right so this direct dye we can use it for uh, animal fabric also animal fabric and also for plant fabric fabric right so animal fabric i have told these things so it it consists of uh, silk wool these are good example for animal fabric and cotton it is uh this plant fabric right so uh, this we can use for uh, coloring these kind of fabrics we can use it for both but uh, for cotton uh, initially they used it for cotton for cotton it will fix very strongly right so this is little story of this uh, congo red right so let us see how we synthesize before going that let us see few more things so what i told in alkali medium alkali medium i can write alkali or oh minus if i write you should understand so in alkali medium or in alkali solution it will be red in color red color and i told it is very sensitive to sensitive to acid so if i add any inorganic acid hcl like that from red it will convert to violet so that thing also i have told right how it will convert the reaction that i will discuss right and it is the first synthesized dye so first synthetic dye it is and they used it initially they used to dye cotton directly right these are the few points of this uh, congo red right so i hope you understood the structure so this is the structure of congo red congo red right uh, if i explain the synthesis then you can easily remember its structure so how we synthesize it right let us see that now right how we synthesize that let us see that so what i'll i'll do i'll take this compound right see here it is simple two benzene ring like biphenyl you have seen like that you just uh, take this biphenyl here you add azo group diazo right and here this nitrogen hang plus charge and cl minus will be there and this are also like this and triple bond n this nitrogen is hang plus charge and cl minus will be there right so this compound so this is called as azoto 
सुठो टाइज्ड बेंजीडीन राइट टू दिस व्हाट आई विल ऐड आई विल ऐड टू मॉलिक्यूल्स ऑफ दिस वन सी हियर इट स्ट्रक्चर इफ आई ड्रॉ इट विल बी क्लियर सो दिस वन आई विल ऐड सो हियर एनएच2 शुड बी देयर एंड पैरा पोजीशन SO3H should be there. So this is naphthionic acid, right? So what happens? So when I add like this, see here. So this, uh, this I have explained that because of this nitrogen is having positive charge, so it will take this electron density, and this uh, nitrogen gets positive charge, so it acts as electrophile. and here also it takes the electron density and this nitrogen is gets positive charge so it acts as electrophile right and here this come to this uh, naphthionic acid here what happens see here from this the electron density will be given to this similarly i have two molecules right one more molecule will give to uh, similarly one more molecule ha i will have and from that it will give to this uh, not from same molecule only right one more molecule because two molecules we are using right so what happens this is electrophilic substitution reaction so this is nothing but simple electrophilic substitution about these things i have explained in previous video so i am not going to write any intermediate step directly i am going to write the product so what happens see here so from one molecule see here from above only I, i am starting with so like this here nh2 group is there here so3 group is there so3h so what happened from here it attacked to this nitrogen so n double bond en right so it is attached to biphenyl like structure i have told right you try to draw that other things as it is right then this position n double bond en this will be having positive charge right so one more molecule will form this here like this if i draw you will get to know right here nh2 is there here so 3h is there so electrophilic substitution reaction like this right so intermediate step i am not going to write so finally i will get this congo red right so in this way you can remember initially when you see it you feel like it is very difficult but when you see the reaction you feel like i can easily remember that right so n double bond n see here how easily i am drawing it right the same way you can easily remember it so n double bond n and again here nh2 here so 3h and here like this right so this is my congo red Congo red. I hope you understood, right? So I told it is very sensitive to uh, this one acid, right? So in basic medium, what happens? This basic medium means OH minus will be there. So this proton is acidic, so it takes this proton. So if I remove this proton, I'll get SO three minus here, and here also if I remove SO three minus. So its color, they observed that it is red in color, red in color. But when we add this uh, acid to this. inorganic acid like hcl like that inorganic it is very sensitive so from red it converts into this violet color why this happens is because and also you may ask sir why it is red because here so many canonical structures are there means pi bond all are in conjugation right i have told as uh, conjugation will be more like this like conjugation is more the energy between this homo and lumo will decrease so energy between homo and lumo decreases energy decreases sorry decreases wavelength increases because both are inversely proportional right so wavelength increases means it may lie in uh, this uh, visible region so uh, let us assume that it will observe at 400 nanometer means it is uh, like see here if i want to draw like this p b g y o r so it is appearing red means it is observing green color light so green wavelength will be around how much 500 or 600 right let us assume that it will observe at 600 nanometer so it appears red 
so it absorbs green color and appears red in color right i hope you understand that right so further uh, what happens in acidic condition right that's the common question so what happens here h plus will be there in acidic conditions right so uh, this nitrogen will be having lone pair so it will attack from this and here also excess of h plus will be there and this nitrogen is also having lone pair it will give its so we will get this structure so see so i hope uh, like this they gave the lone pair both the way so i am going to write the structure below here just come below right same structure just you add h plus then you will get this this structure only all right so here it will be see initially let me draw all the structures so it will be like here nh2 is there here so 3h was there right and here n double bond n and here like biphenyl structure and here also n double bond n and again repeat everything same thing like this sorry not here double bond comes here because it it will disturb the conjugation right yes double bond comes here and double bond here and here nh2 will be there and here so 3h will be there so in acidic condition what happens here the these lone pairs will be taken by this h plus right so here also what happens this this nitrogen as soon as it gets lone pair it gets positive charge so what happens it will take this electron density so the positive charge will shift on this carbon uh, nitrogen sorry then this bond will shift here so cation that positive charge will come on this carbon right further it can easily give its lone pair and stabilizes the positive charge right this structure i will write that side you please write yourself right so this is this what we get is this one so double bond nh2 plus right and here double bond is there n is there sorry here it becomes single bond now because that pi bond is broken so and here h is there and here benzene ring as it is it is here biphenyl right and here also same thing nh n double bond double bond nh2 plus right other things will be as it is see here uh, here i forgot to show those double bonds right let me show here right so here single bond is not there just it is like this right so if you see the color of this it will be violet color right from red in acidic condition it became violet i hope you understood it right so this is all about congo red so congo red it is a direct or substitutive dye right so other things it is all clear how we synthesize it everything we have discussed right in next class let us see one more uh, dye right